how to bridge to Kronos blockchain. In this quick tutorial, I will show you how to bridge your crypto assets from other blockchains to the Kronos blockchain. Kronos is the first EVM compatible chain built on Cosmos. It means that you can use, for example, MetaMask to interact with this blockchain. If you go to the official site, Kronos.org, you can see this blue button on the top right corner to add Kronos network to MetaMask. Let's do it as the first step before we can bridge access to the Kronos network. Here we can see all the network details and click on approve. And now I can switch to this network as well. Currently I am on Binance Smart Chain, but let's switch to this network. If you open MetaMask now, you should be switched to the Kronos mainnet. Okay, here we are on the Kronos mainnet. They use Cro token as an utility token. So you will definitely need some Cro tokens on your account so you can do the transactions and you can deposit it from the crypto.com exchange or crypto.com application if you have them. But now if you want to bridge assets, you also can do this from the crypto.com application on exchange. You just need to select Kronos as a destination blockchain when you do the withdrawal. Also, they provide a web app bridge. You can bridge assets only from Crypto.org, Cosmos, Akash and Terra network, which is powered right now. Ethereum is coming soon, so it's not very useful at the moment. So to bridge assets to Kronos network, I recommend to use bridge provided by Crystal DeFi application. You can reach it at defy.crystal.app slash bridge or by scanning the QR code you can see on the screen right now. As usual, you need to connect your MetaMask wallet here and uh, under the bridge you can choose the network from you want to bridge your assets in our case i will bridge from binance smart chain and to chrono smart chain as you can see this bridge supports a lot of networks a lot of chains so if you need to bridge assets from other networks you can use this bridge as well for example i will bridge usdc to the chronos network and in the notes you can see that bridge fee is 0.5 usdc it's quite low based on my research and minimum transfer amount is 12 usdc maximum is 20 million usdc but at the moment they have only 272,000 usdc in the pool so it's the max amount you can bridge right now so please always check this information here how many assets they have in their source chain and in the destination chain also by default recipient address will be your metamask address that you use to connect to this site if you want to change it you can edit it here also very important note that the asset you breach should exist in both networks for example, regarding our asset USDC, it does exist both in Binance Smart Chain and Kronos Chain. You can check it on coinmarketcap.com page. By default, it's on Ethereum network, but also USDC available on Solana, Algorand, BNB, Phantom, Polygon, and a lot of other networks as well as Kronos. It means that we can safely bridge our tokens between those networks. So let's enter the minimum amount, in our case 12 USDC and click on approve. Let's confirm. Previously I switched to Kronos mainnet, now it asked me to switch to smart chain again because that's the source network we're gonna to bridge from and now we will give permission to access USDC. Confirm. So first transaction confirmed. And now let's review transfer. So from 12 USDC on the Binance Smart Chain, I will get 11.5 USDC on the Kronos Chain. Bridge fee is 0.5 USDC. Estimated time to transfer 10 30 minutes. There is some gas fee in BNB as usual. And let's confirm. Scroll down and confirm again. We see that first transaction confirmed. Second one is still pending. So I put the video while transaction was in progress, but I accidentally closed this window. Sorry for that. Uh, 
transaction was confirmed and now we can check if we get our tokens in the metamask i switch to the chronos mainnet and uh, i can't see any usdc here i need to import those tokens by i need to have its smart contract address and if we go back to the coin market cap uh, usdc coin page uh, if you click on the more button and find here Kronos smart contract address and copy address. Now we can add it to the MetaMask wallet. Click on the import tokens and paste token contract address. It should get all the details. Use DC and token decimal. And now we can click add custom token. As you can see, we already have 11.5 USDC that we bridged from Binance Smart Chain import tokens. And that's it. We have our crypto here in the Kronos mainnet. But to do any transactions, you will need some CRO tokens here as it is used to pay all the transaction fees. If you go to the CRO page on the coin market cap here, let's search for it, Kronos. And under the markets, you can see that uh, there are a lot of exchanges where you can buy CRO token like Coinbase, KuCoin, Huobi and others. So you need to buy some Kronos here and then withdraw them to your MetaMask address. You can find here, copy it and uh, use it as withdrawal on from the exchange and uh, if you need to do some swaps on the chronos chain you can also use uh, crystal uh, defy because it supports chronos chain as well and now I do the swap like i have used dc 11.5 and i can buy for example chronos but yeah as you can see here i don't have any crow tokens to pay for the network fee so i need to send them to my metamask wallet before i can do any transaction in the chronos blockchain that's it guys please let me know in the comments if this video helped you to bridge tokens to chronos blockchain and see you soon